Hey guys, Mr. Poncho here, and today we're gonna do the next uh, mission or episode of the Once Awake quest because I think that last one honestly didn't live up to what I expected it to be. Honestly, I, honestly though, I can't even blame the game because I probably should have done this a hell of a lot earlier than I'm doing it now. Maybe that. Um, it's probably the biggest factor that took away from, you know, the rush I was supposed to I must say, experience. He infested. Scare the... are very worrisome. Didn't he say... <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, so I'm doing this, um... Right after the... The Lotus would like you to reinstall that mod as soon as... Now! Oh, oh God. God. I'm starting to think Ortis has a little, you know, some issues. But, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do this. Uh, hopefully it's, um, better than the last one. And yeah, see you there. So I'm recording this episode right after I did the other one. I'm trying to upload this as soon as I possibly can. Because honestly, I prefer to go for like quality over quantity, if that makes any sense. Like I'd rather upload one good video for a week than uh, upload, you know, a bad one, like five bad ones. I could have sworn I just flew to like a Corpus ship. Dudes with the bucket heads and everything. We are going to attempt to use a cascade bomb to destroy all traces of infested here. Okay. The bomb will take time to arm. Protect it until it's ready for detonation. Alright, so we're gonna use some bitch repellent on these uh sacks of meat. I like the sound of wow, that looks really freaking cool. In all my time of playing, I have never even seen that. Oh wow, it looks like a giant uh, nipple. Just, or honestly, it kind of looks. I don't know what the hell that looks like. All right, so we're gotta gotta protect this pitch repellent. I didn't intend to step right into the circle, but hey, whatever. Oh, okay, now that I'm here, gonna wreck. Oh, okay. Well, we're trying not to let them get. Oh gosh. Oh, dude, that guy. He is like, forget Poncho. <laughs> Going for this bitch repellent over here. Oh! <laughs> he kinda juked me out. I thought he was going for the bomb, but nah, he's, he's here to win. Go after the big guy. Oh my gosh, these guys mean business. <laughs> Alright, compared to the last one, these guys are already showing up. Oh, he's... He says, forget gravity. Alright, hold on. Let me... Oh, it... <laughs> Alright, cool. First wave. Oh, wow. Nine remaining waves. Oh! Cool. Alright, good job, Poncho. Maybe I should... Oh, no, no, no! Ah, uh, did I miss you? I got you both. <laughs> oh, oh. Stop bragging, Poncho. That'll be your downfall, sir. Oh. Okay. Did he just... He's <laughs> like, forget this. Poncho too strong. <laughs> oh. Well, thanks. <laughs> Working out the crick in my neck, I guess. Oh, this guy. Yeah, he's a toughie. It's always causing problems. Okay. This guy is like a leaper, he's, he's called. Hmm? Interesting. This dude's hard to hit. Kind of funny looking. Oh, I got 30 kills. Thank you. These creatures that... appear to be mindless monsters, but they know we're up to something. And they're trying to stop it. That is actually a really scary thought. No lie. Like they, these things have a goal. <laughs> Ooh, man. Like, what if zombies were actually just working for like a leader or something? Honestly, they're not doing a very good job at doing <laughs> their job. Like they're missing every hit <laughs> against the bomb. Like I could just sit here and let them go at it. Did they hit it yet? Okay, good. Well, yeah. <laughs> Man, but like I was saying, that that is actually kind of uh, kind of a scary thought. If any of you played Halo, you know the Flood. They were, to me at least, my first time playing uh, against the Flood. I was freaked out, honestly. And I was playing in the dark like I am now. 
and compared to how I am now, this is honestly nothing. But man, <laughs> it's kind of cool though. I'd love to see what Warframe can do with that. And I'm actually really interested with the background story. Wow. I swear, I'm gonna give you like... Wait. Oh, never mind. Work that back. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, they could damage your health directly. Kind of forgot about that. So are they gonna land a hit on this thing? Though? Oh, that guy there. He's having a little trouble without his legs. What is up with this? Hmm. <laughs> well then. You know what? I think I'm gonna just go ahead and uh <laughs> meditate. It's cool. Oh, meditate while I'm invisible. See that? That is classy. I may even do a little dance, honestly. What is this? Solace Narda? Oh. Oh. Nice. Oh, if you're wondering what's making me go invisible, it's that uh that little buddy I have up there. Is a sentinel. Oh, nice bow, nice bow. Alright, so before now nah, whatever. <laughs> Man. Oddly enough, this is not boring though. <laughs> I have to say, that is so cool to look at. Whoa, whoa, what was that? Was I wasn't the only one that saw that. Ew. Whoa. Oh, it's just going through. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> when will you stop rolling? Oh, there's somebody here. Hello! Greetings. I come in peace, and you come in pieces. And you end up in pieces. Wow. That, that would have been a great line, but I just had to mess that up. When this cascade bomb goes off, a wave of void energy will tear through the complex, ripping the life force from all organic matter, but leaving the structure intact. It's our only chance to stop this gorge before it starts. Damn. Oh, what is that? What is that shining? Oh, <laughs> dang, he's like, yeet. All right. Speaking of void energy, uh, or void in general, I, I haven't taken you all to the void yet, but given... The fact that I am just completing this quest, it just, it's, it seems completely out of sync, honestly. But maybe, I don't know, the quest after this, maybe if I complete the quest after this, I'll take you guys to the void. It's really cool, though. Like, they are basically the pimps of Warframe. And you'll see exactly what I mean. <laughs> like, it will make so much sense. And they also have a major, um... Mm, role in the story. Sorry. I just did not understand that word. So apparently they're all coming out of here. Hi. I don't want to wait for you. I'm kind of impatient. Hello. Hello. Wait, wait. Gotcha, son. Alright. Gosh, I love this Excalibur rework. Man, I'm getting the weirdest sense of deja vu right now. <laughs> like, if any of you remember it, in one of my earlier videos, I had, and during Voice Prize, we had, um, this kind of mission where you had to defend this point and I was so into that <laughs> you will not have alpha <laughs> something like that I don't know but man I was into it I was kind of hoping that would be what this is but these guys can't even <laughs> hit the thing so I don't know cascade bomb my cascade bomb my beach repellent oh now that was kind of sick all right, I'm gonna start doing tricks now. <laughs> Wait, all right, who can I see? Oh dang, missed him, missed him, missed him. Wow, I missed every shot. The bomb is almost armed. You just have to hold out a little bit longer. Will do, Lotus. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. All right, whoa, all those limbs though. <laughs> Come on, guys. Second to last, whoa, okay, hi. Oh, he landed a hit, this guy knows what's up. <laughs> okay then. Well, oh, <laughs> Poncho, you gotta aim, Poncho. Oh, they're landing hits, wow. I guess the closer it gets to the end, the more serious they get, I guess. Oh, man, okay, don't go for the bomb. Great, right, where'd you go? Wasn't there a guy? The bomb is Did I just kill him? Wait, what? Huh? Okay. 
<laughs> Whatever you say. Okay then. <laughs> wow. And after all this, I still haven't even seen that doctor. Like, Tangus, was it? Hmm. Seems to be like this undercover kind of guy. Or maybe he's already... No, he's not dead. That's stupid, Poncho. Because who let the infested out to kill you in that first mission? <sighs> Silly Poncho. By the way, that first mission was friggin' great. I expected to be scared out of my pants. I played this in the dark and everything. You have new quests in your codex. Wait, what? No. -uh. What? The inbox has messages for the operator. Anything about orders in there? No orders. I'm sorry. Wow. Complete. I don't understand. That was it. Like they make it look really cool and whatnot, but I guess I delete it. Is that what I do? Clicked it. I guess I'll just let it load. Wow. I expected so much more out of that. Well, the good news is um, now I guess we have better things to move on to. I guess that's the silver lining here. We've gotten that out of the way. Wow. All right, so I got another message in my in uh, inbox. Hopefully that gives me a little more closure. <laughs> I don't know, because that's really what I need right now, honestly. Messages from the void. Void. Recurring theme here. Hmm. Infestation eradicated. Tenno, the caps... The cat... Isn't Cascade like a dishwashing brand? Anyways. Tenno, the Cascade explosion worked, and the asteroid has been purged of infestation. I'm afraid this new threat cannot be so easily contained. Dr. Tengus' experiments with this plague are grossly irresponsible and have been, oh, whoops, and have threatened the entire system. All that is needed is an infected ship to reach a populated area and will be unable to contain its spread. There's no controlling it. The Grenier will just, will be in just as much peril as we are. So prepare, oh, to prepare you for this new fight, I've sent you something that should prove effective against this menace. Let's hope you will not need to use it, the Lotus. These items have been delivered to your inventory. Oh, oh wow. Yeah, this is definitely for beginners. Cause I'm, I got, mm, I don't think I have any more space for weapons, honestly. Oh man, it sucks. But yeah, I guess for any of you trying out this game, um, this is what you get. It actually, it's a really big help fighting it. Oh look, I can make him not. Uh, this is re it's a really big help fighting the infested since they're you know weak to fire and whatnot. Um, if you'd like, I could get into more, more of that like weaknesses of the factions and whatnot. Um, but yeah, wow, that was the end. Definitely not at all what I expected it to be. Like I expected to be super, super scared. Like, no lie. And it doesn't even tell me what to do next, honestly. Wow. Three missions. Three whole missions. Okay. Gotta say, I'm kind of disappointed at this quest, but it is out of the way. Better things to do now. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, hopefully we'll get into scarier things in the future. Darker side of Warframe, Tenno, maybe. Your codex has been updated with a new quest. Gosh, Lotus. Oh my goodness. Hold your horses. Like, for example, we all we all know what I'm deeply, deeply afraid of. No, no. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Stop it. Oh! Anyways, thanks for watching. Um... Make sure to leave your feedback down in the comments. Tell me which quest you want me to do next. Uh, and yeah.